Hi and welcome to new tutorial in Autodesk Inventor. Uh, like I say to you, in this episode we will make an inlet manifold. Okay, um, because starting, I I did this just with using few features, and uh, in the next episode we will make. Uh, the other uh, cylinder head the left one I think because we did the right one uh, it's not the same because one of you posted a comment asking me uh, I I used just the, the mirror feature to make the left one but uh, this is an error you can't make this because uh, the left one it has another um, or opposite uh, dimension okay and to make this uh, here we can uh, see the the right cylinder head and here the left one okay then this feature uh, this part the inlet manifold um, I came between the right one and the left one cylinder head okay then uh, let's start uh, the work um, I will close this and start a new file start part here then start from the right plan here it's not like so it works but uh, y Z plan select this and go to sketch use center rectangle or two point rectangle here use 52 here 52 in the second um, dimension and use fillet with uh, I have dimension here 26 between these same thing here and five between these and these now I have to use circle here and here make them equals select two of them and make them equals and use uh, dimension again to put here six millimeter then go to model extrude extrude it with two millimeter I have to use this profile I click OK I need to use shield with edges select this and add the circle with 50 by date I have to use sweep feature to use sweep feature you have to use two sketches the one is this circle the second I will draw it in the XY plan okay start the line from this and put here 60 okay here we have 122 here the angle is 142 and here have to put 46 here but why it's green because I have to add mm, dimension here we have 60 here now is fully constrained then I have just to use feature with 60 hair be between these and 40 between this one go to 3D model swap feature and use this like um, profile and this like uh, target and click OK the same thing click in this uh, face go to sketch and 
use center rectangle if you have not see the point go just here to see this point the center and put 52 here 52 in the last side in the next side go to fill it put here 26 the same thing here then 5 here and here um, now add the circles you have to click in this point to have circle with um, 6 millimeter the same thing here but this equals to this extrude it with 2 millimeter then uh, now we have to add the same the same part to this one but move it from to this one and mirror to the plan we will create now to create this the to create the mirror i have to use the plan this plan we would use um, we we'll use um, we we'll draw uh, sketch with a line here center line not the center line construction line like this one and add diameter not diameter distance between these we have uh, 55 59.8 uh, we will adjust this dimension in the uh, when, we, when we make the assembly, okay, just validate, then go to plan, choose angle to plan around edge, okay, select this like an edge and select this face, not this face, I think. Mm, let's choose. Let's choose this one. Then put it like this. We have to put 22 here. Okay. Then choose. Um, all thing is all right now. Go just to mirror. Choose here mirror or solid. I create a new here, not join, but a new body to select select mirror plan, select this one, okay, and click OK. You have to notice that we have two solid here. Now this solid we have to move it mm, move on, I think. Move on. To move this, go to modify, move body, and choose this body put 0 here and 20 here click OK and use combine, we we'll have to combine these bodies go to split here, we will find combine select these and click apply make sure join is uh, is on here click apply we have now one solid here and use fit it with 10 millimeter here in the radius select this click OK mm, we have just to make this visibility take off of this and the last one is the shell put shell with 2 millimeter select all of these faces to make holes here now I think you finished your work you just to add aluminum here or style style where is the style since it's style okay you see that is so good then in the next tutorial we will make the the right or the the left the left cylinder head to add an assembly between this to the right go to the right and this go to the left cylinder head <coughs> and like I say to you we will adjust this distance where is it 
this distance uh, 59.8 to to have a little distance between this and the right or the uh, the left cylinder head okay uh, thank you for also subscribing I am so happy to this to see more than uh, 2,000 subscribers to my channel and um, I am so so sorry to keep you waiting because I am so busy um, if you have any question or suggestion to my channel don't hesitate to post it I will uh, do my best to share my skills with you Thank you and see you next tutorial.